Roof Source here. Today we're doing a roof evaluation on this 80 square apartment complex here in Los Angeles. We'll do a core cut on our roof whenever we're out here doing one. A couple reasons for that. Number one, it allows us to see how many layers are on the existing roofing system. But number two, it allows us to go down and see what the deck is made of on that roof. Number one, it gives us attachment methods if we need a re-roof, such as a mechanically attached system or a fully adhered system. But number two, if we do have to put a re-roofing solution on the building, it lets us know what our fire rating of our new system needs to be. Whether we have to tear this off and put back a new Class A system, or whether we can re-roof going over the top depending on how many layers are on there. So for doing our core cut, we're going to need three main things. Number one is our core cutter. Number two is our M1, which we're going to use to patch our core cut. And then a Stanley to cut open our M1. I like to go in the middle of our cap sheet run here. So I'm going to start here, put our core cutter down. see what our roof consists of. Now that we have our core cut out, we can see we have a plywood deck and we had one built up roofing assembly on here. So this is the one and only roofing layer here on this project. We're gonna put this back together now and seal this up. We're gonna take our M1 squeeze tube, take our knife, we're gonna cut this open. Now that we finished sealing up our core cut with our M1, in 30 minutes this will be watertight and we're good to go. If you have any questions or would like us to walk any buildings with you, check out your project. Give myself or your local roof source member a shout. Have a great day.